Right, hi there, back again. Uh, sorry, I've posted for a while, I've been a little bit busy. Uh, as you know, this is the powder coat oven with the air recycler and things like that. But I just want to show you this. There we go. What I'm attempting to do is to burn off some powder coat in this oven just to see if we can. Um, uh, it should be good. We don't know. We'll soon find out. Uh, there's the powder coating rig. I'm having a few issues with this to be fair. I've taken off the, um, the vibrating plate. I didn't like the way that works. So now I've got the um, fluidization air all sorted out. So this is just gonna be to do our satin black. I don't think I'm gonna do anything other than satin black with it. Um, the satin black that came out was great, but I don't really wanna be um, messing around with uh, uh, I don't really want to be messing around with changing colours in it because it is an absolute ache. So what we'll probably do is use the... Uh, I'll move away from that noise a minute. Um, what we'll probably do is use the... Uh, use that 45 litre tum just for satin black and use the uh, Eastwood for any different colours because we don't do much in the way of different colours so it should be all good. Um, I don't know whether you've seen, but there's a little stairs project we're in the middle of doing, which with this uh, COVID-19 business is, is, we're being hampered a lot. Being hampered by supply, by people, uh, other fabrication companies shutting down. It's been a bit of a nightmare. Um, I've got my new high temperature wheels from my rack. There they are. So they're cool. I got four more of those coming. Um, as you can see, there's a vibration plate. Let's put that away. Uh, and I've drilled holes in this and just try to make it all, you know, as efficient as possible. What I am going to be doing over the next uh, few days, while I've got a few days by myself, because uh, my guys have decided to self-isolate, which I completely respect and understand. Uh, with it only being me here, I can work relatively freely according to the government at the moment. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to try to use that rack uh -huh, to move that oven to there. So that is gonna be a mighty, mighty shift. Um, we need to move stuff around. We need to change things a little bit. Uh, I have got 23 more of these to make. Uh, I haven't got the steel for it. Not sure I can get the steel for it, but they all, all need to be galvanized and powder coated. What's in there at the moment actually is a motorcycle swinging arm that I'm trying to burn the powder off of. So I'm hoping that we can get to 350 degrees C I don't think we will. It's been stuck on 346 for a good while now. Um, I think we're at max. So, there we go. Anyway, what I'll do is I will get back to you uh, with an update as soon as I can. Uh, as always, if you like the videos, if you like the content, please subscribe. Uh, uh, it's what inspires me to keep on making these videos. And so, yeah, hit the like button or the dislike button. I don't mind. Uh, if you hit the dislike button, I'd like to know what you don't like about it and maybe I can improve. Uh, if I don't know, you don't tell me. I don't know what to improve. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, please subscribe, like, subscribe. Always up for it. And uh, maybe I'll show you how I go about making these kite steps for these stairs and show you the finished product in a later video. So anyway, take care now. Uh, stay safe. Keep washing your hands. Keep staying nice and clean. Stay away from people. If, you're, if you get to stay indoors, please stay indoors. Uh, I'm very lucky. I've got no... I don't see anybody. I just come straight from my home straight to the workshop I don't interact with anybody uh, so I'm fairly fortunate in the fact that I can self-isolate as well as work so before there are any naysayers out there uh, I really really don't see anybody and I could show you my trip into work uh, if I wanted to but there we go so anyway like I say stay safe uh, like and subscribe and I will see you all later cheers now